Tuesday the 24th of March 2020. I will fear no evil. Psalm 23, 3-4 KJV. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the paths of righteousness for his name Sarke. 4. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me, thy rod and thy staff they comfort me. The soul is the realm of the intellect, the place where dreams and desires are birthed. The soul is the seat of emotions, passions and appetites. The soul is one that animates the body and directs human behavior. The soul is governed by three things. 1. What I want. 2. What I think. 3. How do I feel? The soul can either be subject to God, meaning that it is directed by faith or can be governed by the enemy of your soul and it is controlled by fear. He restoreth my soul. To restore is to take something back to its original version. To restore is take something back to its former glory. To restore is to take something back to a place of lost privileges. He takes my soul back to its place of original intent. He places me back into my original version. He takes me to back to factory settings and do away with all impurities. How does he restore my soul? By opening my eyes of understanding, exposing me to the truth. Once my eyes are opened, it becomes to see the light of the word of God and follow its leading. The moment you beginning to see the light you will gain confidence, trust and will be firmly persuaded in that which God is doing. It becomes easy to walk in a particular direction without the fear of getting hurt or losing something. The only way you are going to walk in the corridor of righteousness is when your soul is subject to the Spirit of God. The path of righteousness is full of life, there is no fear of COVID-19. Though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death I will fear no evil. This part of the psalm is so realistic it doesn't paint life as just something blissful experience but rather shows us that we are going to be threatened by sickness, lack of opportunities and the upheavals of life. It shows us that you are going to experience a lockdown, your business deals are going to be strained. Your success story is going to be rewritten otherwise you are going to succeed but you are going to walk a very hard road but you will get there. COVID-19 is real but there is no need to live and walk in fear. I am not saying don't take precautionary measures, stay at home under lockdown if you have to, but in all this fear no evil because God is with you. God promises us in his word that he will never leave us or forsake us. Rather he is right whispering into our ears saying this is the way walk ye in it. When you develop a talking relationship God which is all he wants from us, he will give you wisdom on how to deal with issues like coronavirus. He will tell you the place to go the things to do and he will assign his angels to take charge over you. Just keep trusting and believing God don't be scared. God has got you he is standing with you right now in the middle of a storm. No need to be afraid Jesus is in the boat the storm could be really strong like a coronavirus but Jesus Christ is far much stronger. Tell yourself that I am hygienic, I am well, I am healthy, I am peaceful, I am preserved. Message from Stanley Kujokara, Pastor, Facebook, YouTube, HPMI Arcadia Mega Church, plus 263774131396.